build a stairway to the stars, a lovely stairway to the stars. It would be heaven to climb to heaven with you. Hi, neighbors, and welcome to Stokely Van Camp's Little Show. You know, lately I've had my eye out for a nice little place in the country, and I think I have found just the thing. So uh, how about coming with me on a make-believe visit to the farm with that well-known corn-fed favorite? How you gonna keep them down on the farm after they've seen Paris? How you gonna keep them away from Broadway, jazzing around, painting the town? How you gonna keep them away from harm? That's a mystery. They'll never want to see a rake or plow. And who the deuce can parley foo a cow? Oh, how you gonna keep them down on the farm after they've seen Perry? They'll never want to see a rake or a plow. And who the deuce can parley foo a cow? Oh, how you gonna keep them down on the farm after they've seen Perry? You know, somebody once said you can take the boy out of the country, but you can't take the country out of the boy. Believe me, when it comes to home cooking, here's one boy who's mighty glad of it. And that wonderful country freshness is just what you can expect whenever you see this label. The label for Van Camp's pork and beef. Now, folks, what is a label? Well, actually nothing but a piece of paper printed for and blank at. And yet you and I know that this piece of paper is the reputation of the largest packer of pork and beans in the world. And when you look for this label, folks, you are saying, I prefer Van Camp's because I know Van Camp's buys the best, sells the best, tastes the best. And you know, too, that wrapped around a can, the Van Camp label will bring you good-eating pork and beans, juicy, plump beans in an abundance of richly flavored tomato sauce topped with a right-sized chunk of sugar-cured pork. So, ladies, when you see the grocery man tomorrow, ask him for the label of quality, Van Camp's Pork and Beans. And try our New England-style beans, too, for a heat, eat, and enjoy treat you'll love. Well, I saw an ad in the paper this morning that said, For sale, regretful. Beautiful Blueberry Vale Farm, ideal for year-round home, owner must sacrifice, inquired farm for E. Dunlop, owner. Well, you know, I sense a story between the lines of that ad. I read it to three bows and a peep, and they feel the same. In fact, they're waiting for us at the farm right now. Gosh, the story E. Dunlop just told us sure makes you feel blue. I know, and I'm sure John will feel just as badly about it as we do. But you certainly have to hand it to E. Dunlop, letting this place go at a sacrifice like that. Just goes to prove that a farmer's life is no cinch. Oh, I wouldn't say that. As E. Dunlop just told us... When it comes to fancy dancing Or to music with a smile Or to nice romancing Make mine country style When it comes to arms that hold your eyes That shine about a mile Like I just now told ya Make mine country style Hear that fiddle I could listen all night Hear that guitar Play that something Darn right Dance, share a loving cup with different partners for a while. But a hitching up with make my country style. All join hands and circle to the right. Grab yourself a pretty girl, hold her tight. Chicken in the bread pan, pecking at the dough. If you want this chicken, you better go. Hear that fiddle. I could listen all night, hear that guitar. Wait, that's something. You know it's right. Dance, share a loving cup with different partners for a while. Start for hitching up with Make Mine Country Style. Make Mine Country Style. Make Mine Country Style. You're right. Hi, Arlene. Hi, Arlene. Hi, Arlene. <laughs> 
Gee whiz, say, this looks like the real thing. Wonderful place. Oh, huh? you'll like it even better when you get to know it, John. Oh, well, huh? wonderful. Finally found the chicken that was trying to cross the road. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, not many farms can claim a view like this. Well, tell me, how come she's so sad, fellas? Oh, that's quite a story, John. Maybe she'll tell it to you. We stroll the lane together Laughed at the rain together Sang love's refrain together And we'd both pretend it would never Day we cried together, cast love aside together. You're gone from me, but in my memory, we always will be together. You're gone from me. but I'm looking for the owner of this farm, an E. Dunlop. Why, I'm Ellen Dunlop. Oh, these for Ellen. Well, what do you know? My name is John Conte. You've uh, certainly got a lovely place here. Tell me, why do you want to sell it? I don't want to. I've got to. In order to go to college. Oh, really? What college? You call it you. It's an agricultural college. Hmm. Selling a farm to go to an agricultural school is like selling chickens to buy eggs. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Suppose I rent the place from you instead of buying it. Oh, do you really like it that much, Mr. Cobby? I like everything about it. In fact, here's a bit of news that's quite a shocker, proving Mother Nature still has charm. Taking a tip from Mr. Knickerbocker, get in the swim and buy a farm. Farming, that's the fashion. Farming, that's the passion of our great celebrities of today. Garbo Peep has led her sheep all astray. Owen, new potato throwing. Old tomatoes makes them feel more glamorous and more gay. They tell me cows who are feeling mooey all give cream when they're milked by Dewey. Farming is so charming, they all say. Oh, Owen, new potatoes throwing. Old tomatoes make them feel more glamorous and more gay. They tell me cows who are feeling mooey all give cream when they're milked by Dewey. Farming is so charming, they all say. Oh, farming's the life for me. <laughs> I can see you've got the right attitude, Mr. Conti. But you don't want to rent the place until you've seen the inside of the house. Oh, I can tell by the outside. It's beautiful. Well, I just the same. I'd like to make sure it's in fitting condition to be seen. Will you excuse me? Do I have to? I'll be right back. Well, all right. Oh, I know you talking, neighbors. This country air does something to a man. And when Ellen comes back... I'm going to tell her. Take me where the daisies cover the country lanes. We'll make hay while the sun shines. We'll make love when it rains. Take me where the songbirds thrill you with sweet refrains. We'll make hay while the sun shines. We'll make love when it rains From the hustle and the bustle of the city We'll become a pair of country folks In a little cottage sitting pretty We'll be Mr. and Mrs. Ghost Take me where the daisies Cover the country lane We'll make hay while the sun shines We'll make love when it rains from the hustle and the bustle of the city We'll become a pair of country folks In a little cottage sitting pretty 
We'll be Mr. and Mrs. Dokes. Take me where the daisies cover the country lanes. We'll make hay while the sun shines. We'll make love when it rains. Hey, what's the news, Jack? Did you find the place? No, Arlene, I am renting it from Miss Dumlop, oh. including this beautiful international farm all cub tractor. How do you like oh, this, baby? Oh, that's a huh? perfect solution. <laughs> You'll have the prettiest landlady in all the country. You're lucky. Oh, can we come to visit you often? Well, I'll be sore if you don't, Arlene. Oh. And our Miss Van Camp, too. Oh, boy, what meals I can picture for you. <laughs> Did you say picture, John? Well, let me mention a masterpiece in eating that's worth gracing your family table. Van Camp's versatile macaroni product, Tenderoni. You're doing the honors with chicken soup. Wonderful idea, isn't it? And for your growing children, a noontime lunch dish that will send them back to school bright-eyed and alert, not sleepy and dull from too heavy a meal. And at night, when the head of the family comes in hungry and tired, serve him Van Camp's Tenderoni and chicken soup, and you'll probably get an assistant with those dishwashing chores. And... A husband who will feel peppy enough to ask you to the movies. And ladies, you'll feel peppy enough to go, too. Because when you use Van Camp's Tenderoni, the meals are so quick and easy to fix. Tenderoni cooks in just seven minutes. It's another Van Camp take-it-easy treat. Well, here we are, Miss Dunlop. The lease all signed and seat. Gosh, Mr. Connie, I can hardly believe it. Well, why not? It's as real as everything else around here. Then will the party of the second part join the party of the first part in a song? Parties of the second, third, fourth, fifth, and sixth parts will be happy to oblige. Everybody hand in hand, swinging down the lane. Everybody feeling grand, swinging down the lane. That's the time I miss the bliss that we might have known. Nights like this when I'm all when the moon is on the rise, honey, I'm so blue. Watching lovers making eyes like we used to do. When the moon is on the wane, still I'm waiting all in vain. Should be swinging down the lane, swinging down a lover's lane. Should be swinging down the Well, Jimmy, there's milking to be done. Off with you, old boy. And Phil, the horses have to be fed, don't forget. Right. And Lester, Arlene will need some more firewood for the kitchen. And Arlene, I... Uh, uh, don't tell me I can take a hint. Mm-hmm. Thank but... you very much. Well, now, Miss Dunlop, that we are practically alone... Excuse I've... me, Mr. Coffey. I think I hear my date at the front door. Your date? But, Miss Dunlop, you can't do this. Well, some days you can't make a dime, folks. Anyway, that's our bit of ruralizing for this time. Thanks to Ellen Dunlop for making so attractive a farmerette. And, of course, the usual thanks to three bows and a piece. Next Tuesday, our Stokely Van Camp's Little Show will take you on a make-believe trip to San Francisco's famous Chinatown. Beginning with... San Francisco, open your golden gates. So try to join us again on Tuesday, won't you, friends? Our guest will be lovely Sandy Deal, and you'll know you're in the right place when you hear... Let's build a stairway to the stars A lovely stairway to the stars With love beside us to fill the night with a song NBC Television mm -hmm.